Hi friends, welcome to LearnSub.com. Today we are going to see about Squid for Windows. Squid is a caching and forward HTTP web proxy. It has a wide variety of uses, including speeding up your web server by catching a repeated request, catching web DNS and other computer network lookup for a group of people sharing network resources. It is primarily used for HTTP and FTP. Okay friends, now I am going to show you how to install Squid on Windows 7. For installing Squid, you have to download a package of Squid. For that, go to your official site for Squid, Squid for Windows. Go to this link and then download a MSI file. After downloading, open a package. Now we are going to execute this application. It has to run, click run. Now the installation widget is started. Click next. In here it asks for a license. Click check this box. I accept the license agreement and then click next. Here it asks for your location. Give your location and then click next. Here click install. The installation is on progress. Now the installation is complete. It shows the icons are displayed in a desktop. Click finish. In here it shows a squid icon. Click it and open squid configuration. It will open the squid configuration file. In the file you have to add a rules and use the squid and you want to open a squid folders means click open a squid folders it shows all the directory this is about the installation of squid if you want to use the squid you have to add a rule in a firewall for accepting the tcp port in firewall for that open a firewall setting in rent give a command firewall.cpl it will open the firewall settings go to advanced settings in here it opens the firewall advanced settings in inbound rule you have to add a new rule for squid click a new rule now we are going to add a port so that click port and then click next we are going to add a tcp port specific port number for squid default port number is 3128 and then click next Allow this connection, then click next. Click next here. Give your any name or a squid. I just give squid a friend test and then click finish. Now the new rule is added. Close the firewall. Now the installation of squid is completed. And this is about the installation of squid in Windows. In upcoming videos, I am going to show you how to configure the squid. Thanks for watching the video. Please subscribe our YouTube channel, Ben Excel. For further tutorial, visit www.linuxhelp.com. Any queries, mail us to support at linuxhelp.com.